Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi. <laughs> Hi guys. Uh, Kara here. I just wanted to share with you a little bit of a self experiment that I've been doing lately. And it's been a ton of fun and I've learned a lot and I felt really, I felt like I needed to share with you. And, and I tried to write a blog post and that just wasn't working so I thought it would best come from me in the form of a video. So I know I don't do these very often but I'm excited to maybe start doing them more. So I guess the last, I mean, I think 36 days I have been doing some things that are a lot more intentional with my diet. Now, normally I am pretty moderate in all areas. I say that all the time. Um, I really believe that you should enjoy life and, and, you know, but make those indulgences, if they are indulgences, more calculated and more intentional and more conscious. But I was kind of, to be honest, a little bit off the rails and I really... I was running a marathon and just, you know, training a lot. It, you have the perception that you can get away with a lot more than, than you think you can. You can get away with a lot more than you actually can. And I was eating things that, to be honest, I would never touch before. And it's, I just, I needed to reset. So along with a really beautiful system, I decided to change the way that I was eating in a more intentional way. Now, I've been interested in this whole paleo sphere for a long time, and I've eaten paleo-esque for a long time, but I've never really given it my all, and I've never been strict about it, and I was really excited to see what would happen, because for me personally, I know I don't do well with a lot of refined carbohydrates, I don't do well with high carbohydrates, and in my past, when I have experimented with reducing the amount of grains, I felt great but I was never in a place where I could do it 100%. So that was the last month and a little bit of my life. And I know that's a really, really short period of time, but I've learned so much. And I think for anyone on the journey who is curious or interested, or maybe you've dabbled around with it a little bit, I feel like I'm coming from such a different place. And honestly, I feel so good that I will not be stopping this anytime soon. So a little bit of kind of what I did, and I call it paleo-esque because I believe that there's a lot of myths around the paleo diet and there's a lot of stigma and some negative things. And I just really believe that like any diet, so did you know Oreos are vegan? They are. So Oreos are vegan. What? So you can eat a poor diet regardless of what diet you're eating. And I see that in paleo just like I see it with any other type of diet. And I really believe that you need to listen to what your body wants. What did I notice from 36 nowadays grain free? Um, biggest thing, energy. Oh my goodness, I don't need as much sleep, which is amazing. I've been getting up extra early, which I will talk about in another video or a post, but I just the amount of energy has been amazing. Mental clarity, also phenomenal. And my sleep quality, going along with not needing to sleep as much, sleep quality is definitely improved and those have been my big things along with you know physical performance and I, I'm an athlete and I'm, I've had a lot of fun at the gym and I feel like my muscles are stronger and I'm able to you know I've been able to increase the amount of weights that I lift and that's been really exciting so I, I've been able to see some really neat changes and a little bit of body composition changes as well which to be completely honest are fantastic and I'll take those anytime so those were my big benefits from going.